All right, folks, welcome. Uh, tonight I got a very special guest joining me, uh, the man of 10,000 voices, Michael Winslow. Hello, Michael. How's it going down there? What's up, Melbourne? What up, y'all? <laughs> <laughs> I can hear you out there, but, you know, for a few seconds it was... <laughs> Remember, that was me, but the other part isn't. Uh, things are good down here down here in Melbourne, and uh, is it actually ten thousand voices that you can uh, you can do? No, oh, man, we're way past that, man. You, uh, that's a couple of video games ago. Oh man, we uh, need we need. Oh, to, go ahead, go ahead, go wait, ahead. I, wait. I, just, I just recommend I recommend everybody make noises because who knows you might even end up being your own video game. You never know. That's right. Uh, we need to get you a marquee on your website, kind of like McDonald's has. Every year, you can change it another billion voices added. Huh? You bring up a good point. You, you bring a great point. That's a great idea. But don't tease me with with that. I might just do it. No, but it's uh, it's free. It's uh, it's, it's yours. <laughs> we, we know. I, when I thought about that, because the new game that's out right now is called Wizard Ops. That, that that's what we did. It's it's actually a local Florida company uh, called Fight and Media that put this together. It's called Wizard Ops. It's the first video game that's all human voice. Wow. And and you know a video game can easily be five hundred layers or something. So sure. five hundred to a thousand noises. At that. That's that's not unreasonable. That's a cakewalk. It's not unreasonable at all. Yeah, my son will be very excited to hear about that. Play with it because I know I know they're working on a part two right now. Yeah, we'll we'll check that out tonight for sure. I off right off the bat, I wanted to mention two things. I wanted to let the folks know out there that uh, we are very excited that uh, BPS Magazine and Chris Kissy Lynn Productions are going to bring Michael Winslow in concert live at the Sports Page in Satellite Beach uh, Friday night. The uh, Fifth is it the fifth? I think you're. I think you're. You're about right. Yes. Uh, uh, but that's you know what, sports page. You know what? A little bit of sports never hurt anybody. That's what they say. Yeah. Right. Exactly. <laughs> uh, and uh, and it's an all ages show, and tickets can be found online at www.winslow.evenbright.com. Oh, okay. That that, that works. That's uh, a mouthful. Can and they Michael also Winslow, MichaelWinslow.net will also put you to MichaelWinslow.net would be the easiest way for them to go. Plus, they can or, find or or last up. Yeah, your choice. Oh yeah, uh, and then people can uh, if they go to MichaelWinslow.net though they can find out everything that they ever needed to know. I was looking over your uh, your uh, history there a little bit, and uh, I had completely forgot that you had pretty much uh, broke on the Gong Show. Oh God. Yeah, bring hey, bring him up, huh? That's sure, right. why not? <laughs> you know, I, I got to be honest with you. He was he was fun. He was fun to fun to talk to and hang out. He was a little crazy, man. Yeah. You know, I you know I, I read the book. Yeah. And and I don't know what to make of it. You know. Yeah. But with, with all the stuff that's going on right now, who knows? Yeah. You, you, when it, when you think about all the craziness stuff that's going on right now, you, you never know. Who knows? No, you don't. And uh, that was quite an interesting book. It's been quite a while since I read it, but. Uh... Well, the movie was insane too. Yes, I do remember seeing the movie too. He's a pretty wild character. That was that was the first. That was the first. That was my very very first opportunity, to, you know, to get exposed to that. And it, it was America's Got Talent. I'm sure is a lot crazier than, than this was, but this had its own. This had this had its own brand of crazy. Oh yeah, yeah, that was an insane thing, and. Uh, <laughs> Kind of like smoking the bandit on steroids. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we, I'm, sure Burt Reynolds, I'm sure Burt Reynolds was, was, was poking around there somewhere. Do you do you remember who was on the on the panel when you were on? I think Jamie Farr, uh, uh, Jamie Farr, uh, uh, Pat McCormick, and somebody else. Oh yeah, cool. Joanne Flug. Pat probably. McCormick, who, who ended up being uh, Big Enos on Smoking the Bandit. Yeah, man. Well, speaking of movies, you know, uh, those of us that didn't catch you on the Gong Show, probably uh, first time out may have caught you on uh, one of the Cheech and Chong movies. Uh, Gosh, yes, of course. And, and you know what? That was, hey, you know what? I'll take whatever job I can get my hands on, because back then, uh, I was living in my car. So, yeah. So, you know what? If, if, if it requires me making noises like them, hey, I'm going to do it, man. Ah. Yeah, me too, man. <laughs> hey man, what's going on out there, man? Mel- Melbourne, man. No, it's Melbourne, man. Hey man, you're slowing up the loan of Hey man, so what's going on out there, man? The sports page, all right, man. Make that some Mexican sports, man. Make some wrestling. No, they don't do wrestling, man. Yes, they do WWF, man. Now, come on, really. Is that you or the guys in the car with you, Michael? Oh man, that's me and Dana. <laughs> Watch out, man. That's brilliant. Yeah, uh, but I remember that joke when the two sticks wasn't underwear. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? Um, I want folks to come out and have a good time because that's 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 what we're here to do. And 
Hopefully folks will come out and have a good time with us because uh, our job is to help y'all forget about the rent for an hour. No doubt. There'll be lots of, there'll be lots of music, good stand-up, there'll be some surprises. You know, we're just going to do a kitchen sink approach. A couple of crazy things. We'll probably pop those in the, in the mix too. So you'll, you'll find out. Get your last on. Right on. We'll cover everything from Armstrong to Zeppelin. Don't worry. Oh, cool. So they'll hit it all. I, I know when I caught you two years back, uh, three years back over there at uh, in Cocoa Beach, uh, I was uh, I was completely blown away. We had a wonderful Cocoa time. Cocoa Beach. <laughs> yes, Cocoa Beach. Yes, Cocoa Beach without the cocoa. It's okay. But Tony Nelson will return one day. Him and Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> Tony Nelson will return one day. <laughs> you know, I knew a guy in 1977 when I was living in New Jersey. And and I was 17 years old, and we would go to the park, and he is the only other person I ever heard do anything similar what, to what you do. Everybody else had boombox, but we had this guy. And he would do, right. he, all he ever did was everything off of Led Zeppelin physical graffiti, and he was our uh, soundtrack in the park. It was very bizarre. Yeah, right. We had a guy in Venice Beach, California. There was a guy in Venice Beach who would uh, dress up in, 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 with Arabic headdress, but he would play Jimi Hendrix music. But but he would be, 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 be in gibberish and on roller skates. Crazy! I think I know who you're talking about. At least I maybe I've yeah. seen him in a film or the, something. The, the, uh, they, they called him the mayor or something. Hey, you know I saw something on your website that looked very interesting and very fun. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about going on the Jimmy Fallon show? That's uh, coming up on the 18th, and uh, I'm just as curious about it as you are. Yeah, um, that's going to be on the 18th, and uh, I want to do some things with the roots. That's so, awesome. It'll, it'll be it'll be crazy, and we'll see we'll see what kind of insanity we can come up with. Michael Winslow jamming with the roots. That'll be too, too cool. Looking very forward to that. You and me both. <laughs> and, uh, and looking forward to seeing you at the sports page uh, on uh, next Friday night. Can, is there anything else you want to uh, you wanna, you wanna partake or, or, or leave, uh, leave our audience here today, Michael? If, if they want more, then they can just go to michaelwinslow.net and play with the noises. And I'm sure they'll give them a pretty, pretty clear, and that'll connect them to you, to you as well. Right so, on. Like I said, we'll see you then. And you know what? It's good to be on your screen. I hear you. Michael, thank you very much for taking the time for chatting with me today. I'm looking forward to seeing you next week. And don't forget, everybody, when you hear that funny voice, it is now time to get your laugh on by pressing the pound key now. That's all you have to do. <laughs> That's beautiful. Michael, Thanks, thank buddy. you again. You have a great trip up there in Georgia. You too, man. Take See care. you soon. Peace. Bye.